We start tonight at 9 in Marion, where Limmar's homecoming parade allegedly puts the school's LGBTQ plus group in the path of hate speech and attempts at violence. That's all according to the student's parent who posted about everything on social media after Wednesday's parade. Iowa's News Now investigative reporter Nick Elhaj is checking in with that school group and law enforcement about all of the allegations tonight. What should have been a day of pride and unity for the Spectrum LGBTQ student group at Linmar quickly turned into a frightening and hateful experience. That's according to this Facebook post shared publicly by Jennifer Pitkin. Pitkin says students marching were met with slurs and insults, and at one point someone threw this box cutter at the group, nearly striking her daughter. I was driving the float uh, for Spectrum, and I noticed a student in front of us that was carrying our banner saying, hey, pick that up, pick that up. It was a, like a box cutter thrown at our group as we drove by. At that time, I think they all just tried to put on a brave face and be strong and support each other, which is what they do all the time. Support for the students has poured in online, with dozens of community members commenting on the post and condemning the act. In a statement, Lenmar Community School District condemned the incident, calling it unacceptable and that it does not reflect the values of the district. The City of Marion also commenting on the incident, confirming that Marion PD have started an investigation. This isn't the first time Lenmar Community Schools has faced challenges regarding LGBTQ plus policies. Just last year, the district was involved in a legal battle over a policy protecting transgender students, sparking protests and debates. And though that policy was ultimately rescinded, the issue of inclusivity in the district remains a hot topic. Words have power to hurt and to heal and to bring love. And I would hope that they think next time before they act so negatively. I don't think hate should ever be normalized. Um, do I think the students can handle it? I don't think they should have to. For now, Marion authorities tell Iowa's News Now that even the FBI has been in touch and is starting its own investigation. Reporting in Marion, Nicole Hodge, Iowa's News Now.